Hi, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video today, we discuss how we're going to merge all these layers that we have created into one composite layer. So let's begin and understand Merge Visible, Merge Down, Merge All and Stamping Layers. So once you've finalized that layers and now you wish to make them into one layer, there are various options that we have. We can flatten the image, that means merge all layers and all the effects, all the layers come down to one single layer. We have merge visible that only merges the visible layers. With flatten image, it will also merge all the hidden layers and visible layers into one composite layer. But merge visible will only merge the visible layers into one composite layer. We have merge down feature which only merges the selected layer. So in the layer panel, you will select few layers and only those layers will become one composite layer. The last is the stamping layers. Now this feature gives you the flexibility to create another layer with all the composite layers together. So guys, let's move forward and do all this in Photoshop. Let's dive in. Hi, so in this tutorial, we will learn about flattening imaging, merge imaging and merge visible and stamping of layers. So these, all these four things are used to composite layers into one. So let me start with where did I start my image? I just had this image with me. It was just this image. Over it, I got this man which I had converted to transparency over hair and I got him hair on this image and then I did not like his shirt color so I did this and changed his shirt color to black and also applied a filter which converted the background layer to grayscale but I did not like it so I'm not going to use it, I'm just going to keep it invisible. Now if I go ahead and do merge visible, it's just going to see, so my merge background copy has this man pasted on it so with merge visible merges only the visible layer now let me undo and let me type in this thing flatten image i'm not going to do that but flatten image actually merges all the layers while as merge visible only merges the visible layers now, i always want this man i want this man and this t-shirt color you know where this man should have the t-shirt color now I don't want to go with that gray color so I'm gonna merge this color so to merge two layers you select two layers by clicking at control pressing control and clicking the layers and then right click merge visible so this gonna merge these two layers together stamping is an another option which actually creates a new layer rather than having these lists uh, selected. Let me control Z and I want basically with all these things, I'm selecting these two layers, I want a separate new layer created. So I'm going to do right click here and stamping is a way of creating all these merged layers into a new layer. So I have these three color layers selected. So I want this background, I want this man, I want his shirt to be black. So I'm going to create a new layer. So the shortcut is control shift alt E let me come back here, Control shift alt e together, creates a new layer with all of these while I have everything there already. So this is how stamping works. I hope this tutorial made stamping, flattening, merge visible and merge layer clear. So again, flattening will basically combine all layers, merge visible will merge only the visible layers, and the merge layer will slant the merge down with select only the selected layers and stamping will create a new layer with the, your selected layers. One more thing, please remember once the merge layers are saved, it cannot be converted back to separate layers. So if you still have some editing over, do not merge those layers. 